Right, I'm joined by Shoggy, who's back with fan camps. 3-0 uh, looks pretty convincing on paper. Was it convincing? Yeah, it was a good performance. I just thought Ipswich were very poor, to be honest with you. It was just a matter of how many goals we were going to get in this game. Um, Ipswich didn't do anything going forward. I think... Um, yeah, the way I was... I was, but I said 2-0. I was expecting a really tight game. I thought it was going to be a long afternoon because no Mick McCarthy, you know, he, like, he likes to go for it, you know, and he likes to try and get points away from home. And they had a, a good away record, probably the best in the league, I heard. So Yeah, they don't concede many goals to this, so surprising Newcastle put three past them. Looking at the lineup. Any, any surprise for you at all? No, I wasn't actually because uh, Rafa knows what he's doing. He, he's, he's one that picks the team and I think, to be honest with you, you don't change a winning team and yeah. we're doing really well at the moment, so I was, I was happy with it. So happy with the 3-0 win. Um, notable performances, who like, stood out for him? Like, wow, that was decent. I thought Perez's was, performances was much better improved today. He's going uh, to grab the highlight headlines, isn't he? Yeah, for, and I thought Richie, to be honest with you, was definitely a standout today. I think he played really well. He was you. making things happen. And so, going on to Tudor then, we were speaking about Perez there. Diome, now you see, now Diome sat on the bench and watched that happen with Perez. He's going to look at himself and think, I need a performance, don't I? Surely Diome's going to come in Tuesday and he needs to perform that number 10 role. Well, I think he's, he's a bit lazy. I think he needs to try and up his game because, to be honest, against Barnsley, he was pretty poor, wasn't he? I mean, he didn't have the best of games. I mean, he was in and out. And I think, to be honest with you, I, I wouldn't play him on Tuesday, to be honest. I'd keep the same team as I played against Ipswich. Who would you play? Would you play? Um, I'll just keep the same team. The we same team. Not change it, but no. Rafa is going to change it, but no. Yeah, oh, he will. So. He will. Mitch to start, maybe Diom in the 10, you'd think Rafa give, give, give Mitch Rich a chance. I mean, he came on, what, the last 15 minutes? I mean, he, he didn't react to that much, to be honest, because we were already pretty much cruising at that point. It was about 2 0 at the time, so. Yeah, it was game over, wasn't it? And That's he brought it. off the big guns, brought off Gale, he brought off Shelby, you know, he knew that the game was won. Um, just want to touch on the Bobby Robson thing on the 76th minute. Ipswich fans, fair, fair play at them. All of the stadium was singing Bobby Robson. It was a nice, nice moment, wasn't it? The man's an absolute legend. I mean, you know what? It was absolutely fantastic. I mean, the atmosphere, the, you know, the, everyone getting together. That's what it's all about. You know, football fans coming together. You know, in, it's not you often know, as well, is it? No, it's, no it's not. Set of fans can no, be it's nice. not. And it's, ama it's, it's amazing as well what social media can do because I, I heard it was an Ipswich fan or something that put out on the social media. I think it was on the Facebook or something like that. You know, can we give the Bobby Robson the, you know, the praise and the credit that he deserves because yeah, this man's an absolute legend. Return the wave picture, mm -hmm. they haven't actually... They're having a Bobby Robson uh, day on the down Portland Road. Full credit to Ipswich Town. I mean, absolutely fantastic. The man's a legend. Yeah, now looking at the league table, I don't know if you've seen the Norwich result. Yes, they got beat. Was it 1 0 off Preston away? Yeah, they got beat. We've got. Oh, Preston. sorry, Preston, yeah. Uh, so uh, they got beat 1 0 away. And Huddersfield did win. It, did win. They got a last minute win. So three points clear of the league now. Is this true Newcastle starting to slowly come out the woodwork? I think now? we're starting to find where rhythm now. I think we're starting to, to string some results together. And I think it's important that we keep keep you know winning games, even if we have to win ugly one or two nil. As long as we're, we're winning games and you know we're winning you know comfortably, even if we don't win comfortably, just see out the games. You know what I mean? I mean Norwich, you know they're going to be up there because they're a very good team. And Huddersfield, you know they've had a blip, but that's. that's you think they'll pay it off? I think they might. I think, but you know you never know. They might get in the playoffs because you know there's been a few teams in the past that have somehow managed to scrape it at the playoffs, like Brentford in the past. You know, yeah, so you never yeah. know. So going on, just going to touch back on now, moving ahead on Tuesday then. Uh, we've already talked about it, Rafa will probably make a lot of changes. Do you think there'll be loads? Do you think they'll like the likes of Wes Adara? Uh, what about Lazar? Do you think they'll change the centre backs? Even maybe a right back, keeper? So many questions for Tuesday, isn't it? It's a, well, it's a good question actually, because will, will Matt Ells get his, you know, get his run back in the team again? You know, we've been the cup, um, you know, will he? It, it's the quarter if, actually, it, we'll, be, we'll be pressing in the quarterfinals of the cup, yeah. which brings optimism. Are you one of the fans that likes a cup run? Or you I know, no, no, absolutely no, no, no. I'm a big fan of it. I think we should keep the same team and see what happens. So just go for it, because you know, Preston are not going to be, you know, oh, we're, we're going to be pressing three four. Now they're going to be coming up, you know, because I'm such a good run at the moment. You know, they're, 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 they're going to fancy with. You know, I think we've hit them at the wrong time, but then the way we are playing at the minute, it could be, a, it could be a very good night. And I think if you know, if we just stick to our A plan, you know, we should, we should be, a, should be a good game. Thank you very much, James, for coming on, Sean. No, bye bye. Thank you very yeah, much. Bye.